Well, hello everyone. Welcome back to another exciting episode of Josh Talks to You Mild-Manneredly in front of a microphone. And in this fun little episode, I just want to say, welcome back. It's been a while, and uh, this channel's been pretty empty recently. And I thought, well, it's been pretty empty Reg um, besides all the the fun little insights into my life that you've had the misfortune of having to see. So I'm very sorry about that, but I hope you can forgive me because I actually had a great time uploading my life for you guys. Thanks. Um, <laughs> whoa, I don't know why that became so passive-aggressive so quickly. Hello everyone, it's been a while, and this is a little channel update. Um, I'm not gonna promise anything, and I don't think people really care. But, I got some ideas that I want to do in terms of video content. Mostly because I have the time now, because... Update! Your boy... G -g 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 graduated! Um, yes, I graduated from university. Um, last, uh, last month, actually. In the month... In the supple month of May. <laughs> in the supple month of May, I graduated, and... It was a good time. It was a very good time. Um... I'm pretty sure the Snapchat, like, videos will be out soon. I'm just gonna download them. Anyway, uh, I'm having a great time existing, and, ooh, my phone. Um, summer's tr been treating me good. It's been treating me, uh, pretty good, for the most part. Except for the part that I am, uh, waking up in a, uh, sweaty haze, um, simply because, uh, it's hot. It's hot, dude. It's it got to like um uh, like around a hundred, hundred and one this week and last week. It was gross. It's not something that most people are used to, but I'm not gonna say it's because I'm a desert kid because I've had a lot of time to get antiquated to the weather here in, in the Central Valley. But I have to say, it's been pretty hot. It's it's also a very dry heat, as what. The Fresno is known for, so it's just it's just gross. Um, yes. I've had the AC on full blast. Actually, my family dictates that, and uh, but the fans in my room are dictated by me. And uh, yeah, anyway, bad. those are those are always on blast. Um, what do I have in store? Well, recently, I'm not gonna promise anything, obviously, because who knows. Um, I have a lot more free time now, and I just want to record stuff and talk about life again, and that's always been a great thing for me to do, so I'm pretty sure there's going to be more, um, Josh's Limited Discussions, and I'm going to bring, I'm going to bring those back, because those are exciting, and those are filled and packed with so many manner of details that you wouldn't think, um, they would be. But I will be bringing back Josh's limited discussions, at least for a little bit. Um, I always had fun with those, and I always had fun talking about something random and just just talking. Uh, probably we're gonna be talking about uh, Dino Sentai or the Dino Knights, the Ryu Soldier. Um, they're they're pretty cool, and I'm pretty sure I'm gonna reserve my opinion for when I actually do a Josh's limited discussion on that because. The Super Sentai and the Kamen Rider franchises haven't been leaving the best taste in my mouth recently, and I can talk about that because I have a lot more time. So Josh's limited discussion, I'm get, I'm gonna definitely try to bring it back because I I enjoy doing it, and um, people don't care about my opinion, but I I enjoy putting it out there. So that's one. Um, Weeknight Radio with Josh makes it uh it, it it's still being worked on. I'm not going to say anything concrete. I'm not going to say what it's what's going to happen to Weeknight Radio with Josh. As some people do know, I have a I have this long-standing joke with my friend group for uh, from the early days of high school when we all had our own Skype groups together. I, I called it Weeknight Radio with Josh, and it was just like a self-centered kind of thing. But then it developed into its own like monster that spanned multiple like groups and mediums and. It's it's a great experience, um, but I actually want to do something with it. And I do have a short-run podcast that I did make. It's really bad. Um, 
Weeknight Radio with Josh, episodes one to ten, season one. Y- you can tell it was filmed on a on like a rinky dink microphone, but it it has some heart. It has some heart. Uh, I I never discount any of the works I've done because they're they're funny in a lot of ways. Hmm. So, Josh's limited discussion. Weeknight Radio with Josh, although. Probably gonna gonna keep that one bookmarked as of lit yet. I don't I don't want to reveal too much about what I want to do with that. But thanks. And um, we're gonna be talking about K-pop some more because again that that era of the world is still is still in my soul right here in my in my chesticles, and I really enjoy that world. Mm, it's still gonna be Mamamoo because I still love Mamamoo. It's been three years going, my favorite girl group of all time, and, oh, I just dropped my uh, remote on the floor, um, my favorite girl group of all time, and they deserve the best, and we should definitely try to talk more about K-pop in general, mostly the groups I care about, but I haven't been listening to much, I've only been listening to, like, certain songs, like, Pentagon's been getting me, uh, BTS got me hooked again. Because uh, boy, boy with love is amazing. Um, yeah, definitely gonna be talking more about that. Um, video games are definitely gonna try to come back because I just like playing games, y'all. I like playing specific games. I like streaming specific games. I like having a good time with people. So we're definitely gonna try to bring games back in general, and I hope you guys are gonna be there for that. And I hope I can deliver because the channel's been kind of just a vlog channel recently, and I'm and people the only hits I've ever been getting is on that one Snapchat video where I recorded the party, and that was a little insane. But yeah, um, good times, good times. And this final thing that I wanted to do for a very long time, not very long time, but I've been thinking a lot about. Transformers. As of yet, um, there was a certain movie released in in 20, 2018 that revitalized a lot of what I love about the Transformers series. And if you don't know, uh, Bumblebee released in 2018, directed by Travis Knight. Amazing film. Wholeheartedly an amazing film. And this is after years of me hearkening for... I'm just calling for better Transformers movies because I hated what Michael Bay did with the series. Albeit, I did like one, parts of three, but I couldn't get with the rest of where the series went. I just didn't understand what was happening. I didn't understand why characters were being treated like that. And I tried to get into the Transformers comic books for a while. And I know some story arcs, and I have some of their comics. I've bought, like, a digital copies of a lot of the Lost Light um, stories. I just haven't been able to get into it, like, vehemently. But Bumblebee is the reason I was brought back, because when I saw the Bumblebee movie, it was amazing. And I'll talk about that probably in a Josh's Limited discussion or something. But I've been thinking about Transformers a lot recently. I've recently started uh, collecting Masterpiece figures again. And if you, if some of you guys know me, that's a pretty big deal because Masterpiece are a huge money sink. Masterpieces and third-party Transformers, I've actually been getting into the third-party Transformer route. They are huge, and they are huge, um, collectible, priced figures. And it's a, I'm blessed to be able to be able to do something like that. I'm thankful that I have the the time and resources to get the funds for those figures but oh my god it's it's crazy so i've been thinking about transformers toys a lot and i just wanted to maybe do a little little uh, set of transformers review toys things not all not everything not like if i if ever has a re- release like chug scale or like legend scale figures i'm not going to i'm not going to do what the big the big boys do like pia and um Ben's collectibles and Vangelis and uh, Bo- like Bobby K. Like I'm, I'm not gonna do what they do because they do some amazing work and I watch their stuff because I like I like in general 
what people have to say about Transformers toys and third party toys. But I want to put my little spin on it and we'll see where that goes. It's going to be called Road to the Masterpiece and it's going to be about me collecting Transformers figures. Primarily G1 style Transformers figures because I love everything. And yeah, that's going to be the next project. That's going to be the next project and I do not know if that's ever going to happen. But I, I want it to. And I hope you guys are going to be there. Probably not. Probably not because this channel is just a hobby channel, first and foremost. It's just a place where I put my things. But there are some people in here that always see my videos and just go, Why am I sub to this guy? And I'm like, I want to give him a reason again. Because it's a good time. Anyway, let's recap, right? Josh's limited discussions. Josh's limited discussions. We're bringing it back. The JLD. Josh's limited discussions where I talk about nonsense and things that pertain to me and things I kind of am knowledgeable about and you get a little brief insight into what I'm talking about what the hell I'm talking about it's a good time it can really be about anything at one point it was about kill a kill and uh, or like kill a kill in that one Japanese anime I was like into for a bit so it can be about anything um, we're bringing back video game content in general because I just like playing games and maybe talking over them maybe put up some more sims stuff because I enjoy making things happen in there um more uh more news on weeknight ready with josh coming soon maybe if i ever get the ball rolling on that which might be soon it'll be a good time talking more about k-pop because i want to do more album reviews and i'm definitely gonna just just finish my catalog and then we'll do we'll crank those out it'll be easy and yeah road to the masterpiece that's gonna be my next big project uh, I have some ideas already on what I want it to be, and I hope every video of every character is something special. That's what I want the scale to be. It might take months in advance to even finish those videos, because I want every character that I care about in the Masterpiece line to receive that level of attention. So yes, I want... I want there to be I want there to be some care put into all the next couple of videos coming out. And also there's gonna be some joke videos every now and then. Whatever I find on my phone, whatever trash I find on my camera, we're just gonna slap them together and toss them on here. The human condition is still going and we're just gonna put some videos up. Anyway, uh, this was an impromptu little recording, but I hope you guys are doing well. I hope you guys are having a wonderful morning, noon and night. And I hope you guys have an amazing day. Thank you guys for listening to this this weird little ramble by a guy you probably don't remember. But hey, man, thanks for sticking around. Y'all take it easy, okay? Have a good time. Not bad.